Hello there, this is Ogre79 with another Jericho playthrough. This, amusingly, is the second attempt at this, because the first time I did this I didn't actually have my microphone plugged in. It was a bit embarrassing. So let's uh, lock and load and take on the entire supernatural enemies. Let's go kick it. I think they're clean, Nige. You sure? The big man there was setting things on fire. Don't fucking touch me. Well, now, who's been making pacts with fire demons? Nasty business, that. You're as mad as I am. Let him go, Nige. I think they're safe. No our feelings, chum. I'm Major Patrick Buckland of the Black Watch, Office of Strategic Services, and this is Corporal Nigel Barnden. Apologies for the reception, but it's been a long time since we've seen new faces in here. Pat Buckland? The same Pat Buckland that served alongside Alistair Crowley in the OSS? You knew my father, Gideon Rawlings. We're with Jericho, same as you. Bloody hell. Then the breach is open again? Sixty-five years. <laughs> that all? Thank heavens we didn't have to wait as long as the last lot, eh? The last? You all might want to sit down for this. Nothing makes much sense here in the Pixies. None of the normal rules apply. Death, hunger, day, night. If you die, the flies take you, and when you return... Well, you may look human, but you belong to the Firstborn. You know about the Firstborn, right? God creates this thing discovers it's too bloody powerful and decides to wipe it off the face of the earth. But he can't kill it, so he creates the Pixies. This box, if you like. It's like a little slice of reality was carved out as a toy box, and we're the toys. It doesn't go away, mind you. It just sits, and it waits for some poor, disillusioned bastard to set it free. But this time, it grows larger. And when mankind manages to shut it away again, it takes a little piece of our world back to its prison. And of course it waits, and it grows stronger. So the next time it gets out... It takes more of our world back with it. And each time, seven poor bastards blessed with a conjuring are sent into the breach to strike at its heart and send it away. Until the next time, that is. What was that? Unwanted guests. We'll have to continue our story some other time. We need to get you to the breach and past Jerry's defenses. Bloody hell! All right, chaps. Stay close and follow me. So, pip pip tally ho. We've been uh, rescued by the British, or at least got into more trouble by the British. I don't know, which is the funny news. Ooh, that's that's some good. Too bad. Yes, that's good. serve him best. Besides, if we didn't close the breach, the Firstborn would escape, and within a matter of weeks, or even days, it would encompass the rest of the mortal world. And then the world we left behind, and everyone in it that we loved, would be like, well, this. I don't know what they didn't just call this Clive Barker's Poor Bastards the Game, which would have been, I don't know, slightly more accurate. Alright, come on, tea and scones at the uh, at the other side of this wall, possibly. Wait right. here. Everyone hold up here so I can spring the ambush like a oh, well. or ignore me, like usual. Yeah, I can see you. That wall's not really big enough to hide your giant dead ass. Trouble us anymore. Wait here. Yeah, okay. Yes, there might be more crates to shoot at. That was easy. Here it comes! <laughs> That's what you get for carrying a large tank of combustible uh, chemicals in your back. Hey, motherfucker! Pit have chosen the least defensible position in the universe. Bastard! You jolly bastard! I'll have your legs. Shirt? Shirt? What's wrong with this shirt? Piece of cake! I 
really they, they do like really shooting me. I, I clearly That's must have some. Oh, okay, good. Thank you, Jesus. No, he's the one that made all this mess. That and God. Yeah, nice job breaking it, God. By the way, with this whole evil midget thing that's causing all this trouble. Right, everybody. Let's 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 sort of be a bit sensible about this. Jericho Squad, hold up. Oh. Oh. Right, Billy. How about that? Oh, that doesn't look good. That doesn't look good at all. None of that. Oh, seriously. Yes, you can stay that way until I've got rid of this guy. Church is down. We lost one. Oh, down. seriously? You are all rubbish. Stay down. Heads down oh lads. my, seriously? Yep, back up, back up, kill it, shoot it, take it, shoot it. Oh, what? Oh, this is just ridiculous. Right, grenades, grenades everywhere. Seriously, why didn't you shut up and start shooting? That would be helpful. Oh, I hate these things. I could use Cole's super slow down speed thing and do this. That's just efficient. I should have thought of that sooner. <laughs> right. No, you're all rubbish. You all get D's in fighting supernatural beings. I don't know why I brought you with me. Oh dear, something's got a bit bendy with the special effects here. Let's see how I can fix that. Temporal loop engaged. Yep, now I'll engage it. Nope, we're still in goldfish bowl of vision. That's not good. Cole, Cole's, Cole's grasp on reality may well have just shattered. Never mind. No, nope, well, that might have fixed it. Right. Hate to say it, but I think we're in trouble. We're always in trouble, Nige. Or Pat, whoever you are. They built the gateway to the next level of the Pixies directly over the temple ruins. We need to get your team as close as we can. Jerry thinks he's gone and got one over on us. Little does he know that we had Private Tuck rig the whole bloody place to explode should they ever overrun us. Ready to give him a bollocking, Tuck? You know what I think? I think we're in hell. If in doubt, it's time for a bollocking. That's what I say. They don't give up, do they? They got Tuck! Damn! We need to trigger that detonator. Jericho, suppressing fire. Abby, think you could do anything about the detonator? Got one. So, in short, Tuck is fucked. Let's go! He'll only be back again. I think we got Tango's it. Tango's down. Well, we'll probably be seeing Tuck again, probably reformed to some giant scary monster of some description. Come on, lads. Tally ho. Pip pip. Alright, so that's another episode of uh, Clive Barker's Jericho. Um, thank you for watching, and uh, I shall catch you next time.